Penn doesn't want Mateo to have a bunch of stage. Yeah. Um, and obviously the same thing. Uh, Mateo doesn't want Penn to have <laughs> too small of a stage. So like this is definitely the most neutral mm -hmm. for them. Like you're gonna see a lot of Mateo turtling under the platform because he doesn't want to be able to get jumped in on. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Over like the. We also have to keep in mind, uh, Mateo beat Penn 3-0 yeah. to make it a winner's finals. Mm -hmm. Ooh, oh my god. Penn is just so good at calling out shield timings. Like, it's incredible. Alright. 23 to side off of it. Nice flame yeah. breath. Catch the roll with the flame breath. Yeah, nice back Ooh, air. trades. I think Mateo fade there, but those kind of situations just you don't want to be Ooh, swinging against the power barely missing. Back air killing? No. We have full rage Bowser 182. Like, Mateo needs to... If Penn gets one opening, not a sack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, catch him. I don't know. I, th I feel like Mateo needs, like, a bunch of openings for him to win. Meanwhile, Penn just needs, like... Yeah, it's... Yeah, it, it, it's, it's just the Palo thing where you need... You're win you need to win neutral, way, like, way more times, and your win condition's just way more, like... Especially against big bodies and like heavy characters, your win condition as Palo gets oh way God, more difficult than usual. Yeah. What was Let's that? Let's go Palo. Uh, but compared to like a character like Bowser, whereas like Bowser is one of those characters that can kill you in two openings. Yeah. Like he, like his win condition is pretty like clear to clear. Oh, nice counter. Whereas yeah, back you see the backer nice. there, and it should okay. yeah close it out. A solid back stop from Teo, like. Stock up. 49%, like, he can work with that. As long as he doesn't get, like, Nair Baird. But, like, he kind of just needs to play it super safe, super defensive. And just, like, not give the pen an inch. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh that's a footstool. footstool. Yep, that's the down yeah. air. That's it. All right. They're running it back. You see, Mateo's too nice. If they were in the yard, for the second there. <laughs> This matchup just seems tough for Bowser. It is a very I mean, tough matchup because, like, yeah, it's a very tough ma tough matchup because, like, usually what the the Bowser wants to be able to set the pace of the game by forcing his opponent, like, into like forcing the opponent into his bubble or have to break through Bowser's wall. Yeah, Palu doesn't need to do that. Like, Palu is very comfortable being like, all right, let me pick my defensive options. Like, if you are going to sit at center, I can like turtle into the platform and like not really commit to anything. And if you decide to go to like far range, I can just start auto reticling. Or again. Or if you like if you jump in, I can just nair. Yeah. It just seems tough for Penn to like do anything. Yeah, also like he eats so much damage. Like you're gonna like Mateo can like consistently get three nairs. And plus Paulo's moves like basically all beat. <laughs> yeah, they have higher moves. priority. Yeah, like that down air got beat by uh, Palutena up air. Oh my goodness. Nair. Oh, yeah. So the one big thing Mateo does not have in this matchup is jab. Like he can't like hold um, Penn in the corner whatsoever with jab because he will just help back to it. Yeah. So yeah. you're gonna see a lot of like Mateo just like almost up. It's very similar to like kind of like a sword character where it does a lot of like landing safe aerials. Like not really wanting to not wanting to touch Penn's shield just to like to put the pressure around where uh, Penn places himself. Yeah. Basically, like, keep, to keep Penn in, like, the, in a position rather than, like, try to, like, like, try to punish, a, like, a good or bad position. This just seems so tough. For, uh, Penn yeah. There. Also, the big thing is, like, ba Palu rising there hits a grounded Bowser. Mm, okay. Because he's just so big. Like, in most power matchups, that's not a thing that usually, like, that usually happens. But, like, for the big bodies, that is something that, like, makes it so much worse. Because, like, you just kind of get whiff punished. Like, we just saw, like, Pen F tilted Mateo once, and he just immediately eats an air. Yeah. And it's also, like, the ledge trapping and just the edge guarding overall is yeah. insane. 
Bowser can't really do anything. And Paulo is like one of those characters that can actually edge guard very well. So it, it's it's, it's just tough. Yeah. She was good at edge guarding, amazing ledge trapping. Like she gets down to two frames. Although they're a little hard in this matchup because Bowser can hug the stage pretty well. Yeah, good DI out on the down throw. Doesn't get hit. Doesn't get hit there. It just feels like Pen, like, it's really hard for Pen to get anything going because there's like Palu's movement here. and like Mateo's just playing so well around kills. Yeah. And yeah, that should kill. 100% Bowser. That one's rage? Yeah. Oh, missed the grab. But I feel like everything has to go right for Pen for him to win this game. Yeah. <laughs> At least he's that he's going he did get a nice 57 off of that scrap. Oh, get up attack. Yeah, now this is the position that's scary because, like, Mateo needs to close out this game now. Oh, this is too much momentum, yeah. Yeah, like, you cannot let Penn have the momentum. That's like, we there. just saw at the end of the last set. Like, he had that little bit of momentum at the end of game five and he was able to run with it. Oh, yeah, should be. Oh, back throw instead. I thought he was going to forward throw him. Yeah, okay, that, that's, that's death. Yeah, yeah, that's death. This just seems so tough. I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely a tough match. Right? I don't know if Penn has anything he can pull out of his pocket, but nor like nothing he has is warmed up besides yeah. his Bowser. But I'm pretty sure he's gonna stick it out. You just gotta make some to, yeah. like you gotta make some fat adaptations. Yeah, and apparently Hayes just said that like. Mateo has a bunch of Bowser experience. Oh, absolutely. Like, with how much he... Almost all the, like... All the top seeds we say here have, like, a good amount of practice against Leon. So it's not, like, not wild that, like, so many of these players are so accustomed to, like, oh, that's their flow charts against Bowser and punishing, a head, like, such a heavy character. Yeah, Mateo is just playing on fire right now. This is, this is oh. Trying to get the ledge trump there. I don't know, there's not, there's not much we could say about this set. It's just it's just tough for Penn, I don't know. Yeah, it's just, it's a tough matchup on top of like Mateo being Mateo being experienced in it and um, like recently Every, yeah, everything's just kinda of, all like I mean, he's just kind of on Mateo's plate, and then, like, Penn is just kind of stuck. Okay. Like, the adaptations he needs to make, he needed to be making by game one, and now it's just, like, everything's running away from him. Yeah, yeah. Penn is okay. just trying for the crazy shit. Ooh. Okay, doesn't break the shield. <laughs> All right, yeah, Nair Bear. Yeah, they're laughing yeah. about it. All right, wow. 3 from right. Mateo. Congrats to him. Crazy 3-0 from Mateo. <laughs> Crazy to see the difference between brands and losers. 